Welcome back. This video will explain how to work with chart notes in a list or table view. You may already know that there are a number of ways to view chart notes one at a time on the home screen or click the dot here or slide on an iPad or iPhone. You can also click the button here to see three large notes and scroll down to see additional notes this way using the scroll bar. You can see ten of the same notes but in a smaller format using that button and then you can print or PDF the notes here. But there's another way that you can view those notes and that's coming down here to the reports area and then clicking tables. The tables area you've seen before where you can actually look at a number of tables. We're going to look at the chart notes or notes chart, notes general, notes telemarketing. We're going to go to the notes chart area and the chart note area allows you to do things like to find today's notes by clicking a single button. Or I can find notes for a particular patient. For example, if I wanted to find things for Lois, then I can just type in find Lois. Well, I thought I had some notes for her. Let's see if I have any notes for anyone named Mary. There we go. So I have a variety of different notes that are in here. And I can also search for keywords. So for example, let's hit the magnifying glass here and do a search for, if I can spell it right, Sarumen. And it pulls up, in this case, 38 notes up by the pie chart circle that have the word cerumen somewhere in that note. Now, I can't click into the field by default, although we can change that so you can modify or edit your notes here for HIPAA reasons. And we're not the HIPAA police, but we have some guidelines that we recommend. And your HIPAA privacy officer can best describe the best way to, uh, to work with notes in the system. But at any rate, right now I can't enter the field in browse mode, but I can in what's called find mode when I'm searching. So again, I'll just type in the word here, and in this case it pulls up 49 records that have the word here, like hearing or something like that, uh, somewhere in the notes. So you can also search for notes based on a date range. So again, I'll do the word here, and then I could say I only want notes that were created in 2018, something like that. And so now I only have 14 records that have a note that says here, somewhere there. Now I could isolate that further, uh, but keep in mind that you'll have to put the information in, such as a category. If you want to further subcategorize all of your notes, it takes more effort, but you can do it. Uh, put in a subject and you can edit the subject line or the status line or the priority line. But you have lots of ways that you can manipulate those notes. You can also sort or arrange them, but that doesn't always make sense in the note area. So I can sort them alphanumerically or numerically alpha just like that. So this is just another way that you can view your notes, but it might have some value if you want to pull up all the notes for a particular patient or for a group of records based on a date range or any other keywords. Thank you.